What's up, guys? Welcome to Rewatch Reality. Happy Wednesday, everyone. I want to give you a quick little update on Mandy and Maurice because, man, they just cannot seem to stop, and it's getting honestly ridiculous at this point. I've never seen somebody try to prove to the world their situation. It's like the more they try to prove that everything is good and they're stable and all the shit that they're trying to prove that they have money, they're not living in a car, the more it's making them look like that's exactly what their situation is. So at least that's my personal opinion. Mandy is all over over the internet as far as a couple hours ago, resharing stuff that Maurice has posted. They're flashing money, talking about how they're living good and that he provides and all this stuff. I don't know why they're trying to prove to everybody. At the same time, it's just like, to me, it's kind of like a bunch of BS. I'm like, we're just sleeping in a car. You're staying in and out of hotels and you're trying to act like your life is all good. It's not all good. She's having a hard time accepting the fact that her life is probably worse now that she has Maurice in it. Anyhow, let me run these clips for you. So last night she posted all this money, right? So they're trying to flash and act like they have all this cash and this purse. My first thought is, girl, you need to go sell that purse, get you some more money, and not to be a hater, but that's not that much cash. Like, I looked at that, that's probably like $1,000 or maybe a little over $1,000. Girl, that ain't even gonna pay one month worth of rent. She goes on to say, no lie, I'm not even a flexor like that, but you lurkers think because I'm with my husband, I'm doing bad. And whoever wrote my sister saying I should leave my husband and that I deserve better, no lie, my husband spoils me and my daughter and my soul. He treats me like God's gift, always respectful to me and my daughter. So please stop DMing my family and sending weird stalker emails to me and my family. It's great over here and Maurice is in the highest happy place he's been in a very long time. I'll be honest though, regardless of their situation, I do think it's weird that people are emailing them, like, let people do their thing. I mean, I'm here reporting on it, cause, you know, we're giving updates, but at the end of the day, to go out of your way to start emailing them shit, it's just like, that's just weird. And even more of the reason why I say that is just, there's nothing that you're gonna say that is gonna change her situation. She will never leave Marie. She's gonna be ride or die. It's who she is, that's what she's about, and there's nothing that we can say to change change that. So as much as we want to save Mandy, Mandy can only save herself. Uh, yeah. See this right here? Look. It's not a little bit. It's a, it's a lot. It's a lot. You feel me? Uh, and my baby, uh, I ain't gonna lie, he handed home. straight to me because you know what? He could trust me. I'm the loyal, solidest woman he ever been with. Yeah, baby, let me do it to you. Here you go, baby. That's for you. Put that up. Thank you, baby. I really appreciate it. I'm getting my feet done tomorrow, my nails done. You feel me? Whatever I want. I got a good husband, so. Yeah, I need it all, baby. You feel me? But yeah, this for this only for the lurkers and the annoying people who get on my nerves and always got something to say. But my baby loved me. Y'all wish y'all wish he didn't love me. Yeah. The 600 on here. Yeah, my baby, you feel me? Yeah. My baby love his wife. You feel me, y'all? I'm not even a flexor like that. But I'm so tired of y'all broke, boring, stalker, lurker, f females sending me weird emails, signing my email. Well, the best way to wrap up this situation is that they're a hot mess, and I don't think that they're going to be making any changes anytime soon. All right, guys, that's all I got for you today on this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment below and let me know what you think about this situation. All right, guys, till next time. Peace out.